So people have been having trouble with the Need for Speed Payback Unlimited Money glitch mm. um, using the hyperspace circuit. So I thought I'd try to do here the most basic um, way I can possibly explain it um, to do this glitch. Um, in your maps, I think you need to be around chapter 3 in order to even get to this. So that may be the problem. Um, so what I advise you to do is check your map and see if you have this area discovered. And it's way at the bottom of your map, down in the city locations, um, you can go to the um, runner dealership and it's right here. It's called the hyperspace circuit. Now if you have not yet raced on this map and on this race course right here, you will not be able to do this glitch. Now that may be why um, some of you are having pr problems and trouble and can't get this glitch to work maybe because you haven't done um that part of the map but if you have this is quite simple you just need to come follow my tracks all right so right out of the runner dealership you need to just come straight here don't take any turns take a slight right and keep the left under this bridge keep going straight take a little to the right and right when you see um, this like bridge gate up here you take your right into this dirt path what you want to do is quickly turn right and try your best to hit up that ramp and on the other side Watch out. like that so once you up here you just need to turn back around you need to go through this barricaded way now you, what you need to do is grind the rail so both of your two left tires should be touching the rail. Something like this. You need to just grind that rail. Move these things out of the way by hitting them. Alright, so once you are here, and once you get to this position, alright, right here. Here's what you're going to want to do. You want to turn to your right. See so you turning to the right slowly. And you're gonna try to get your two left wheels so they're dang like that. And you're gonna try to take the fall. Now, as you see, the first time didn't work. What you're supposed to do is land in between that fence you see there with half of your car on the outskirts and half your car pretty much going through it. Um, and it'll look something like this. Alright, so you get this. You see that menu pop up. It says start R1, but here's what you're gonna wanna do. You're gonna want to hold R1 and drive through the barricade um, that way out there and only let go when the screen turns black so hit R1 and then R2 drive out there for a little bit let go and see if the if you spawn back up on the bridge where you we just jumped from and that menu is still on the screen that means your glitch worked so let's try it like that so you see the menu is on the screen that means that this glitch worked so you can drive anywhere now and that menu will always be on your screen and like in the last video I've done I have showed you how to do that you guys can do the race as many times you want but I recommend only going until you're the only person in the starting line um, doing the race and then you hold R1 to you know like get this menu off your screen so let's just do the race real quick so always decline the side bets if you accept each side bet this glitch is not going to work properly and it's been said that you could lose money instead of gaining unlimited money this way so what you want to do is kind of keep spamming it until you're the only one at that starting line keep declining every side bet the only side bet you should accept is at the last like moment if there's if you see that there's only one car in a starting line with you then you can accept the side bet and then just go and do that race then but i usually don't worry about doing the side bets because they actually don't help you out that much um but so just keep going and doing hitting r1 until you are the only person at the starting line like see right now since it was one person at the starting line with me i could accept the side bet right now but i'm not going to um, so now as you guys will see, I'm the only person at the starting line. So then all you really need to do is just do that race as quick as you can. 
Don't worry about the order, it doesn't really matter because you're technically in first place right now. So just complete the race. Um, and make sure you don't try to beep at anyone. Because if you try to beep at somebody hitting R1 or right bumper if you're on Xbox, um, then it will restart the race and you'll have to um, redo it and you can lose some progress that way, you can lose some money that way. So I would really not recommend you guys do that. Make sure you hit all the checkpoints too. It's not like just because you can just game out, you don't have to hit any checkpoints. It's not, not at all how this works. So just complete this race as quickly as you can. Also guys, make sure you check out my social media. I am on Twitter and Instagram at Dub Gaming Entertainment. Um, I would do a whole se oh I didn't want to do that. I'll do a whole separate video um, on my social media. So if you guys want to contact me and talk to me about um, any videos that you may want to see, you guys can get some sneak peeks or videos to come on the channel. That would also be cool. So you guys would follow me or whatever on social media if you want to. I'm going to be creating them today, so I will make a separate video on my social media to you guys what they are for each day. Yeah, so just keep doing this. And once the race ends, then I'll show you guys how you can get out of the venue. You guys can see there's only like 500 yards left, so we're pretty much going to this race. Alright, so once we hit this final thing right here... Um... So you can see I have 84,000. I had like 10,000 when we started. No, I had like 5,000 when we started. Um, so if you guys want to get this menu off the screen, you hold R1 or RB to change your car. Once you get into this change of car section, you just hit back to exit out, and this menu will automatically be off the screen. You'll be where you stopped, and you'll still have the 84,000 coins. So, I really hope this um, this version was much easier for you guys to understand. If it was, please let me in the comment section. Follow me on social media, Twitter, and Instagram. Um, I will do a separate video. Um, of my social media account so you guys can follow me um, if you guys want to so you guys can talk to me or contact me about videos you want to see and I, that I can do or um, existing videos that you want me to like remaster or whatever um, so thank you so so much for watching this video and if it was useful please leave a like comment and subscribe to Dub Gaming Entertainment your supporters are greatly appreciated See you guys in the next video.